Marriage sexual anatomy. Love is willing the good of the other, as other. We believe that the possibilities of representing respectable content about sexual education presented in scientific papers, books, and documented studios with new visual technologies, like 3D real time animation, special effects, and simulation, can help to reduce the number of divorces. Family is the essence of society, and we should do everything possible to maintain this structure. We know the responsibility that is talking about sex implies and, even more, trying to illustrate the dynamics of sex to educate marriages in its anatomy. It seems that the barriers to doing so clearly and honestly are very high, either because of the sensitivity of the subject, complexity of the format, or, in many cases, the lack of good quality content. We are not experts in sexual health or medicine, but we are experts in 3D anatomical visualization with the support of stable and happy marriages with a deep conviction in our beliefs, with an additional factor in common, and that is the importance to help to keep the families together. We want to tell the story of how sex is a fundamental part of marital happiness. When our partner is our best lover, and love and respect are the basis of that sexuality, the chances of divorce are dramatically minimized. To compensate for our professional inexperience on the subject, we consulted two pillars of knowledge as our spiritual and anatomical guides. The first is John Paul II, with numerous writings and books on the family from which we specifically selected his book, Love and Responsibility. As a guide to the visualizations of dynamic sexual anatomy, we choose the masterpiece of Dr. Robert Latu Dickinson, Human Sex Anatomy. With these two initial pillars and with hundreds of scientific articles, statistics, and books, we decided to undertake the task of building the sexual education series called M Series. Why did we select the book, Love and Responsibility? The author presents in great detail the importance of the sexual act in marriage with specific mentions of orgasm and female pleasure. The author also emphasizes the need for harmonization that allows the woman to reach her climax and demands that the husband understand and educate himself on the specific needs of female sexuality. The simultaneous climax is also mentioned as an option the couple should try. Why did we select the book, Human Sex Anatomy? It is a masterpiece in terms of sexual anatomy. It is impressive how Dr. Dickinson's work contains images of incredible detail in the area of dynamic sexual anatomy, details of the size of sexual organs, angles, openings, positions, etc. Both authors shared a fundamental point of view regarding the importance of sexual education to help to prevent divorce. The story of M Series is straightforward. We want to help each marriage, regardless of how long they have been married. To be close to obtain that each partner is the best lover of the other. We want to help educate marriages in practical sexual anatomy, venturing into the search for joy, pleasure, and orgasms. Love and mutual respect for the other can be strengthened through pleasurable sexual acts for both. M Series is a progressive job. We will produce chapters in a light version for free on our YouTube channel. On the other hand, The educational apps will have content for adults' audience according to the rules of the stores. On these apps, we will present in full detail 3D animations, visualizations, and simulations with visual effects of the dynamic of sexual anatomy. We are calculating the price for the apps as a flat fee of $1.99 without need of sign in, nor capture any user information. All the content for future updates will be included on the original price. They will be a live document that only have chances to improve on any new version. The following are the titles of the chapters, all included on the M Series app My Wife and My Husband, Female Pleasure Anatomy, Orgasms Are Good, Clitoris, Vulva, Pelvic Floor, Marriage Sexual Anatomy, Multiple Orgasms, Kegel Exercises, and Unconventional Anatomy. Below you will find a brief description of each one of them. My wife and my husband. Do you recognize the characteristics of the sexual organs of your spouse? Can you make a list of the top five pleasure zones of your husband? Do you recognize the body signs when your spouse or husband is excited? The marriage sexual anatomy starts with our own bodies.
Marriage Sexual Anatomy, Dr. Dickinson mentions on the preface of his book, Human Sex Anatomy. Quote, the evasion of instructions concerning anatomy in action is a critical responsible for divorces. End quote. On the other side, John Paul II, in his book, Love and Responsibility, also specifies the importance of appropriate sexual education as he wrote, quote, in order to prevent divorces, we need appropriate sexual education, not merely instruction concerning the matters of sex, but precisely education, end quote. In the M series, we emphasize the meaning of the words, anatomy and action, mentioned by Dr. Dickinson, and the words, precisely education, of John Paul II. This chapter presents, with great detail, 3D visualizations and animations of the dynamic anatomy of the sexual act. It displays specific real-day life situations to help marriages to have a better understanding of the dynamic of the sex inside and outside the bodies. Pleasure anatomy. Is your husband's penis too big or too small? Does your husband know how deep he should go to make you feel pleasure? Have you tried different angles of penetration? Is the size of your husband's belly too big that he cannot stimulate your clitoris? These are some of the common questions that, most of the time, we only have the trial and error technique to resolve, which often works, but many others don't. The physics of sex is our friend. We will present real-time animations and simulations including gravity, angles, lengths, sizes, orifices, hair, etc., to show some alternatives that maybe can give you some ideas to resolve the problem. These are the questions of our day-to-day -day real life, and often simple changes can generate tremendous benefits. Kegel exercises. Kegels can improve a woman's and man's sexual experiences. Research shows they can improve orgasms and sexual arousal. On this chapter we will present 3D animations explaining with great detail how to do the female Kegel exercises. They can help some women relax their pelvic muscles during intercourse, making sex more pleasurable. A woman can also do Kegels during sex, which can be pleasurable for her partner. Orgasms are good. Experiencing orgasms regularly with one another is one way that can keep a marriage healthy, happy and strong. Attachment bonding happens between partners during climax when the brain releases oxytocin, fittingly called the love hormone, a neurochemical capable of relieving pain, decreasing stress, and fostering feelings of closeness. This chapter presents the changes of the bodies during orgasms, inside and outside the sexual organs. Unconventional female anatomy in 3D. There is not consensus yet on the medical community about the acceptance of some anatomical and physiological realities. They must be part of deeper investigations to confirm or reject their existence and thus better understand the female sexual anatomy. Does female ejaculation exist? Are the skein glands the equivalent of the male prostate? Does the G-spot exist? Is the function of the Bartholin glands to lubricate during sexual intercourse? This chapter helps to understand these questions by displaying visualizations with the functionality of this unconventional anatomical landmarks and the relevance for the female pleasure. The clitoris. The clitoris has the sole function of providing women with sexual pleasure. It is as essential to a woman as a penis is to a man. The clitoris is made up of the same tissues as the penis, and for the most part, it functions in the same way as a penis when it comes to sexual stimulation. Some clitorises are as big as a small penis. This chapter presents the clitoris and its dynamic transition during the arousal phase, as one of the main organs for female pleasure. Orgasm in an orgasm orchestra, the genitalia may be the instruments, but the central nervous system is the conductor. The human orgasm is remarkably mysterious. To uncover the orgasm secrets, researchers are looking beyond the clitoris, vagina, penis and prostate, to the place behind the scenes where the true magic happens. What is the relation of the vagus nerve networks with the orgasms? Where is located and how to stimulate it? This chapter presents a fascinating marriage's journey based on the anatomy to explore some of the secret paths that you can maximize with your loved one. The vulva. This chapter presents shapes, sizes and many different characteristics of the vulva. 
It is very important to the couple to understand how the vulva evolves in shape with the time and how these changes can create some effects during the sexual act. The understanding and adjustment of the intimacy according with some anatomical changes are part of the marriage journey. Pelvic floor. The sexual education for a marriage cannot be completed without the understanding of the anatomy of the pelvic floor. The muscles, the ligaments, the zones with more sensitivity and so many other aspects of the sexual anatomy changes for the normal aging process or for special events like childbirth. The shape and length of the vagina for a virgin woman is different than the length and shape of the vagina of a woman with frequent intercourse. This chapter presents many of these anatomical changes. You will find the light version of the chapters in our playlist called M Series. For download information about the apps on the App Store and Google Play, please see below in the comments section.